Welcome to pre-math. In this video lesson, we have got this exponential equation x power x minus 1 whole square equals to 2x plus 1. And now we are going to find the value of x minus 1 over x. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's the very first thing we are going to do. Let's go ahead and take care of the left hand side of this uh, given equation. And here I have copied down this left hand side of this given equation. Now let's focus on this part x minus 1 whole square. And we are going to use this binomial formula a minus b square. So this could be written as x power this x minus 1 square could be written as x square minus 2x and then plus 1. And now let's focus on this exponent part x square minus 2x plus 1. And here I have copied it down and let's go ahead and manipulate this one. I can write this 1 as I can write 2 minus 1. So therefore this could be written as x square minus 2x and then plus 2 minus 1. Now I'm going to rearrange these one. I'm going to put these one together and these one together as well. So I can write x square and then a plus 2 and then minus 2x and then minus 1. Now let's go ahead and uh, simplify furthermore x square then plus 2 and here I can take this negative sign outside. So this could be written as negative outside 2x and then plus 1 inside the parentheses. Therefore we can write this one x power. I'm going to replace this one by this uh, different form. So I can write x square and then plus 2 and then minus 2x and then plus 1. And now we are going to use this product rule. According to this rule I can put this part and this part separately. So therefore I can write this one as x power x square and then plus 2 and then times x power negative and in parentheses 2x and then plus 1. And now let's focus on this factor x power this negative exponent negative 2x plus 1. We are going to use this uh, fact and we can write as a positive uh, exponent when we bring it uh, down to the denominator. Let's go ahead and write it down. This part is going to stay same. So x power x square plus 2 at the numerator divided by this part is going to come to the denominator. So this could be written as 2 power with the 2x plus 1. And now we can see that this our left hand side has been transformed into this form. So we are going to replace this left hand side by this and now in this next step our left hand side is this new part and this right hand side is exactly the same 2x plus 1. And now let's go ahead and remove this fraction by multiplying both sides by x power 2x plus 1 on this side and times x power 2x plus 1 on this side as well. And here we can see that this thing cancels out with this one. So we ended up on the left hand side as x power x square and then plus 2 equals to here I can see that I can write this one 2x and then plus 1 inside parentheses times x power 2x and then plus 1. Now let's focus on this left hand side. We're going to be using this product rule once again. I'm going to write these two parts of this exponents separately. So the left hand side could be written as x power x square and then times x power 2. And on the right hand side this thing is exactly same 2x plus 1 and then times x power 
2x plus 1. And now in the next step, I am going to commute their positions of these two factors. So I can rearrange them. I can write x square first and then times x power x square. And the right hand side is going to be exactly same. And now in this next step, I have wrote down this part in parentheses as you can see over here and this exponent x square in parentheses as well. And the right hand side is exactly same. Now in this next step, we are going to use this rule. According to this rule, we can see that this x square and this x square is going to be our a, this 2x plus 1. And this 2x plus 1 is going to be our b. Then according to this rule, this could be written as a equals to b. That means x square equals to 2x and plus 1. And since we are running out of space on the left hand side, I just copied down this one right as you can see. And now we have this thing x square equals to 2x plus 1. Let's go ahead and move uh, this 1 on the left hand. So we can write this thing as x square minus 1 equals to 2x. Let's go ahead and divide both sides by x. I'm going to divide this one by x, this one by x, and this one by x across the board. And now we can see x squared divided by x is simply is going to give us x minus this thing becomes 1 over x equals to here x and x they cross each other out so we got 2. So therefore our x minus 1 over x value turns out to be 2 which is going to be this is what we are looking for. So thus our x minus 1 over x value turns out to be 2. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.